Get up, Jerry. <laughs> nope. Where the hell's Jerry? Let's not do anything hasty now. I'm gonna have to ask you to drop the gun. <laughs> like drop it on the ground? Yup. I'm not gonna do that. Would you rather die? No, not particularly. Look, I'm not gonna drop it until you tell me what's going on here. For all I know, the moment I drop it, you're gonna shoot me anyways. Now, why would I do something like that? I don't know. You shot poor Jerry over there, didn't you? Yep. Look, I'm a bounty hunter. And you and Jerry, you've got some pretty fat prices on your heads. But you're not worth anything to me dead, now are you? Which is what I try to tell you, boy Jerry. <laughs> Unfortunately for the both of us, Jerry was not a reasonable man. Now I'm hoping you will be a little bit more smart than your friend was. Wait, you're telling me bounty hunting's still a thing? Yeah, as long as there's criminals like you running around out there causing trouble, there will always be people like me out here hunting you guys down for cash. Okay, how much do they want from me? Hmm. Let me see. Worth fifteen thousand dollars. Hmm, not too shabby. Now, that's fifteen thousand alive. This ain't the Wild West. I don't get anything for your corpse, which is why I'm gonna have to ask you to drop the gun. Ah, I see. Well, um, this is a very interesting situation. I'm gonna. I'm gonna have to think this one over. Take your time. So if I go with you, I'm gonna have to stand trial for distribution of an illegal substance. The jury will almost definitely find me guilty, as they should, and I gotta do hard time. Now a man with a complexion such as myself is not gonna last very long in the system. Probably not. Now the other option would be to have a good old fashioned cowboy shootout right here, right now. This option, should I select it, has one of three outcomes. One, I shoot you. Two, you shoot me. Three, we shoot each other. None of these outcomes I assume are beneficial to you. Nope. And if I do kill you, then I gotta dispose of your body and that's just gonna be a hassle. But you know what? I think there's a way we can both come out of this clean. Doubt it. No, 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 just hear me out. So you know Jerry over there, right? Yeah. Jerry's my partner. At least he was before you blew his brains out, at least. I'm still a little salty about that. I like the guy. But you know what? There's no use in crying over spilled milk now, is there? No use. Exactly. So here's what we're gonna do. You and I are gonna go over there and pick up the goods that Jerry had in that duffel bag. See, Jerry and I were gonna sell those goods to several smaller distributors to make quite a hefty profit, you see. We just gotta make the same deal with a slightly different crew We'll split the money 50-50. You can be my new partner. Sounds pretty fishy to me. No, 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 no fish involved. If anything, we go through this, we'll get some burgers involved. You ever been to Fat Boys? I'll take you to Fat Boys. Damn tastiest burgers, my man. Already been. Highly overrated. You and I both know that you're lying to yourself on that one. Look, from this job alone, we'll make twice as much as what you'll get from turning me in. Use your noggin on this one, buddy. All right. Fine. Wait, really? <laughs> no. Come on. Did I tell you that today is my little sister's birthday today? <sighs> Sweet little Annabelle would be so upset if I got arrested on her birthday. Don't do this to me. <laughs> Not my problem. Wow. All right. So this is how it's gonna be. Look, just turn yourself in. You don't really want to die, and I don't really want to kill you. You know I can't do that. You 
you sure you want to do this? 